We live in a beautiful country, rich with wildlife, parks and landmarks. Unfortunately, very few of us are aware of what can be found around us. This year, for GovAct 2016, Team Yam have been working on something that we believe will give people a way to truly connect with their surroundings. Introducing Critters. Learn all about wildlife and landmarks around you by playing the stunning augmented reality mobile game. After a brief tutorial, we place players on the map of their local area based on their geolocation. Using open data, the game knows what suburb the player is in, what animals live in that suburb, any nearby landmarks, and whether or not the player is currently standing in a park. As the player navigates the real world, there's a chance they'll randomly encounter a wild animal in the game. When a player encounters an animal, they have a chance to capture the animal on a camera using augmented reality, which overlays the animal on the real world creating a truly immersive experience. Once a photo of the animal is captured, it is saved to your encyclopedia so you can learn more about it in the future. We believe in the power of open research, and that's why we designed a Critter Submitter feature that allows players to take photos of real wildlife they come across and submit those as sightings to the Atlas of Living Australia. So this is a demonstration of the Critters augmented reality app. So start off the app, we've got a onboarding flow, which explains what the app is, and makes sure that the user grants it access to the location, as well as the camera and storage on the device. Then we're taken to a map screen, which once it gets a fix on my GPS, shows my current location here in Melbourne, and a magpie has appeared. I'm going to try and capture this magpie. And oh, the magpie has turned into a koala. Using the augmented reality mode, I take a photo of the koala sitting on my hand, which I can then share via social networks or just save onto my device. Uh, additionally, the encyclopedia stores which animals you've seen and lets you view some information about them. Yeah. Uh, there's a store where you can buy in-app purchases for berries, which increase the chance of finding encounters. And there is also a camera button, which just opens the camera app for taking regular photos if you manage to find one of these critters in real life. Uh, I think we've got... Oh, there's a shark there. That's, uh... Shutters that's scary. So there you have it. Visit all the landmarks, find all the animals, and visit all the parks. That's the ultimate goal.